Hey guys, so in this video I'm going to show you how to deploy your Symfony 4 and Symfony 5 application in share hosting and inside the uh, folder. Say suppose uh, there is a domain a name called domain.com and uh, you have a task to put that uh, folder inside the uh, domain.com slash folder name okay and when you access uh, when you want to access in the URL so that it should be uh, domain.com slash folder name etc etc and you don't want a slash public and those stuff so on so guys uh, this is a quite uh, pain in the butt uh, process in symphony 4 and 5 deployment especially in the server hosting so in this uh, video i'm going to show you how to do it okay so guys uh, recently i got a project where i had to do it do this so uh, the client had told me not to create any sort of uh, subdomain and so on so uh, the client told me to put inside the folder and that's it and that uh, after the dot com slash folder name uh, they wanted uh, to access that project so I spent a couple of uh, say of days uh, I think uh, two weeks um, trying to find the ways how to uh, overcome this problem so I tried uh, almost everything uh, in the internet I uh, posted a question from the couple of accounts in the stack overflow but didn't work i even tried to um i even tried to uh, ask for help to the people um, who are alre already into the uh, symphony development and who has a great experience but uh, unfortunately they mm, they didn't uh, had, uh, sorry they couldn't help me so what i uh, did was uh, uh, what I did was was that I uh, tried on my own and uh, finally I succeeded after a couple of days so it was around uh, after two weeks so what I did was uh, I uh, basically searched everything whatever it was in the uh, Google uh, so that didn't help and one thing uh, I knew about this thing was uh, the symphony and Laravel the uh, since uh, Laravel is built uh, using symphony uh, uh, symphony components so uh, at first i thought the that the symphony and uh, laravel deployment is the same but uh, when i looked into the uh, uh, laravel uh, there was a few extra file okay so uh, at first uh, it didn't come to my mind but uh, but uh, later i implemented that thing and it worked okay so in this video i'm going to show you so as you can see i'm inside the file manager so inside the uh, c panel so here you can see the folder name help and uh, due to some problem and i couldn't uh, uh, display the, uh, this everything because uh, uh, because uh, th this is not uh, my account okay so this is my client account so i can't uh, uh, disclose the uh, url and the project uh, uh, whatever the project is inside the, uh, in, in uh, inside this for uh, inside this uh, a public underscore HTML uh, I better say so let me open the project so uh, this is inside the help and I added two extra extra file so uh, what I did was I, I copied this stxs uh, I got this stxs from the from the laravel documentation i think it was from github uh, i exactly don't know but you can search in the internet uh, you can um, simply search uh, uh, laravel laravel stxs and you'll get all this thing okay and the other thing was the server.php so uh, basically this uh, stxs and the server.php is not there in the symphony so here you can see uh, so uh, basically the, uh, what uh, it is doing here is that it is a uh, redirecting to slash public index.php which means this inside this public folder okay and uh, yeah so this was the problem so after doing this the home page was working well but when I try to access the other route for example uh, for example okay so let me open this and open this uh, in browser uh, okay so when I 
try to access the other route say this list record this thing was not working because uh, this help or the uh, the folder name was disappearing uh, from the URL um, I tried inside the controller I tried uh, inside the controller by adding adding here um, in the routes but uh, it didn't work okay so what I did was I went inside the template folder template folder and inside everything where the route is mentioned uh, yeah, I have uh, mentioned a couple of routes in base.html so here you can see uh, I added here in the uh, in the tweak file again okay? not in the controller and uh, whatever it required inside the uh, each and every folder I first went to each and every fol uh, if, if file and checked whether there is the route or not and whatever required I put that this extra uh, this one the help or the, the folder name the folder name where uh, I want uh, this uh, project to access so what I did was uh, I uh, I put the folder name uh, folder name <coughs> folder name before the route name so it worked and uh, guys um, uh, you have to remember one thing that you have to put uh, before the image as well okay so if you want to render anything so example yeah so this is it so this is currently uh, currently in the testing phase and here you can see so if you don't add uh, slash the folder name uh, in your image so this won't be rendered okay so this is it and uh, I hope uh, you understood well uh, guys uh, I tried uh, uh, this also in uh, free web hosting platform like g0webhost.com but it didn't work okay uh, maybe it would work maybe because I didn't try the much uh, there in g0 we post but here in this uh, cpanel it worked so um, if you find any confusion regarding this i will be i will put the uh, link of the medium where i have uh, uh, written a small article about how to uh, host a symphony 5 application in share um, share hosting inside the folder name and if uh, and if you don't want this last public from the URL so I have written a small article in the medium I will put that uh, put that uh, article inside this one uh, inside the description okay so you can uh, also I have uh, put that code inside that article and if you uh, in time wise in certain days in if uh, the code may be outdated or something so you can uh, uh, you can go to the Laravel documentation and you can go the code from there okay so either uh, either way it's your choice uh, whether you want to go to my uh, article there in the medium or you uh, you go to the uh, Laravel Laravel uh, documentation so basically uh, for uh, the uh, for the current uh, moment it's the same uh, tomorrow this might change okay so yeah guys thank you so much for watching